Well, you might want to call up your girlfriends and plan a date night because Ann Arbor Restaurant Week is back in action. And it is your chance to try out restaurants in Ann Arbor while saving some money, which I love. Yes, and to tell us about what diners can experience, we're joined by Chad Wiebesick from Destination Ann Arbor and Einstein Park from Aurum, which is one of the participating restaurants. Thank you for being here. Uh, Chad, can you give us like a, you know, just a quick overview of Ann Arbor Restaurant Week, what that entails? Yeah, Ann Arbor is an awesome dining scene. It's a vibrant community. Um, it's uh, an award-winning, lots of award-winning chefs and restaurants, and one of the best ways to experience the great culinary uh, scene is mm -hmm. through Ann Arbor Restaurant Week. And this year, there's almost 40 uh, different restaurants, um, and there's something from everyone, from like upscale dining to casual dining, everything in between, a lot of vegetarian, vegan options. Um, and the way it works is a lot of these restaurants have special menus, discounted deals, so it's a great opportunity to come out and uh, either go to your favorite restaurant, try something new, or go to a new restaurant uh, that you haven't been to before and try something new there. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Now, Einstein, you are from one of the restaurants taking place at the event. Mm -hmm. Tell us about the concept of Oram. Yeah, so Oram, uh, formerly known as Of Rice and Men, is actually under new ownership of, of recent. Um, and it is a modern Asian restaurant kind of focusing on shareable plates, uh, really leaning into a fun, energetic type of dining where um, you're not just stuck eating one or two items, but you're able to kind of select different things off the menu with the people that you dine with and try a larger portion of the menu. That's yeah, a fun that's way to. Good. Yeah, that's a fun yeah. way to do it. Um, Tati and I will be sharing all yeah, of all this. Yeah, all of it. <laughs> <laughs> so tell us what we'll be sharing. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Uh, so a couple of different things that I personally love that we're kind of featuring during Restaurant Week. Um, over here in the center, um, this is our mushroom torso rice, which is kind of inspired by a classic Korean dish where a rice dish is cooked in a earthen or stoneware uh, vessel. Um, kind of scorching the bottom of the rice, um, which develops a really nice crispy texture to it. Uh -huh. um, Korea, being a very mountainous country, features a lot of foraging, as well as foraging of mushrooms. Um, and I think it's really fun to be able to kind of flip the idea of a mushroom-based rice dish um, using some local mushrooms that are found here. Um, so we work with a so small local purveyor called Stony Creek Mushrooms, um, and they bring us just kind of whatever mushrooms they find. Um, and you make your work, which yep. is exciting. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, so we got some beautiful chanterelle mushrooms over the top, uh, which are always fun to work with. All right. Um, so let's go through all of them. I want to make sure we just are able to talk about Let's look at, is that beef? Yeah, so this is going to be a braised beef dish, uh, kind of inspired by a classic Korean dish called kaibichim, which was actually part of the royal court cuisine in uh, medieval Korea uh, centuries and centuries ago. Uh, but still a really beloved dish, and we've just kind of modernized some of the plating as well as incorporated some newer elements, uh, which is always really fun. Okay. Now, Chad, Orem is just one of the dozens of spots that will be serving up delicious food during Ann Arbor's Restaurant Week. We also hear that there are going to be some special to-go options for families. That's right. So there are family meals uh, to go, which is a wonderful opportunity uh, for families to get restaurant quality uh, food um, in the convenience and comfort of their own home without having to dine out. So it's a great opportunity for families like me. I have a two-year-old toddler, and it's not always easy to get out at a restaurant. So all you do is um, go to a restaurant, get prepared food, and then heat it up at home. So easy and convenient. That is very convenient. Yeah. yeah. Um, well, all right, Einstein, uh, you're one of the restaurants participating. Um, tell us what the concept of RM is. Yeah, so uh, just contemporary Asian uh, cuisine, uh, just taking inspiration from traditional dishes and just kind of putting a modern twist on it. Um, I think this dish right here is one of my personal favorites, and it does a really good job of that. Uh, this is uh, inspired by the classic Korean street food, tteokbokki, which is rice cakes. Um, Typically, a lot more red and a lot spicier. Um, I was just going to say that. I feel I've had that in red sauce. Yes. Yeah, so, very um, delicious. But we are kind of cooking it in a little bit more of a cream-based sauce, along with some beautiful mushrooms, as well as black truffle. Very okay. nice. Okay, uh -huh. so I'm going to have to cut you off. I'm sorry, because we're just about out of time. Yeah, so yeah. remind everyone how they can learn more about Ann Arbor Restaurant Week. Uh, to get the list of participating restaurants and the menus, annarborrestaurantweek.com. And if you're looking for something to do and see before or after your meal, like shopping or entertainment, 
annarbor.org. Awesome. Thank you both so much for being with us. Thank you. Thank All you. right. To hear about other events and businesses in and around the Ann Arbor area, you can also visit allaboutannarbor.com, which is made possible by these sponsors.